And welcome back, guys. Welcome back to Resident Evil Kill Everything. Resident Evil 2 Kill Everything Run, rather. I'm the Leviathan, and let's continue on with the game. Uh, where we last left off, we had went down into the basement and killed everything, pretty much. So we met with Ada, went through that, and had a little bit of a problem. Now, um, there's only two more parts left in this area um, of the police station before we actually leave it and head on to the sewers. Um, there's an area out here. Uh, which there is a liquor, and then there's an area where there are um, there's zombies that come out the windows. Now this liquor, I know he's over here, along the side, and I hope he doesn't get me. I'm waiting for him to come out in this corner. Yeah, I'm waiting for you. Oh, I didn't go with map. Come on, I'm kind of, kind of, kind of baiting him. I don't know where he's at. He doesn't hear me. But I do that kind of half walk. Where are you at? Are you right there? I can hear it. Let's try. Did I get him? No, he's way over there. Not even close. Alright, whatever. Way to waste a shot, Leon. Yeah, come on, sit down. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. And I didn't even get hit by him. That's good. I didn't waste a shot there, but it's fine. I'm not going to be using the shotgun um, for any more parts. Now, this is the part that gets to be a bit tricky and more annoying. And I'm going to go do this part um, probably right here. Watch. I'm going to watch. See, it was these windows. Yeah, like 9 billion zombies come out of here. And that's fine. But they only come out of this thing. Now, if I, never, if I didn't end up not using the cord, they wouldn't have came out of there. Now, I'm going to go all the way back to where that's at, because it might as well just kill them now, instead of later. Actually, you want not? No, no, no. no. I, I have a better idea on what to do, instead of that. I am going to go where I need to go, and it'll all be good. I'm just trying to think, because I, I've never really done this before, where I've had to go. Usually, I just leave those zombies alone, because I don't really go back through that corridor at all. Now, is there a liquor up here? Sometimes there is. It might be... Uh, B scenarios, but I'm pretty sure there's nothing else up here. Nope, nothing else. That's good, because I really wouldn't want to have to deal with that. <clears throat> so right now we have that cog um, that we got from that one room where we let the, the three fires. And then we get the final plug, which is nice, I suppose. So I'm trying to think of the best route to do this. Like I said, this isn't a speed run, so time doesn't really matter to me for this. So it might take me a little bit of time, but like I said, I gotta I gotta kill it all. You know how that goes. So this opens up a door right here. And you get the last plug. Now I ask you an old dust shoot where you jump down. Now jumping down this conveniently lands you right back down to the basement area. Right next to uh, Ben. No! Get away! Yeah, I'm gonna skip that. Basically, he just gets infected by the G mutation, and yeah, it's really broken. I'm hoping that there's no dogs in this, cause okay, good. Cause I know you wanna know what it is. If you're Claire and you come in this area, it's covered. Um, well, it's not covered, but it's full of uh, dogs, and the dogs really aren't that bad. Uh, obviously, from the last video, I knifed him to death pretty, pretty well. Please don't be free full of things. Pretty sure I killed everything here. I'm just looking to kill the zombies that are uh, up over here. Um, I'm led to believe that they're probably going to be right at the stairs, and there's going to be a bunch of them, so I may just have to shotgun blast them. Yeah, they're probably all going to be right here, ready to eat my face off. Yep. Now, if I can handgun a couple of them. Okay. Can I knife any of you? I know the knife isn't usually the best thing. Okay, let's 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 not knife him. I mean, it's good to use a knife, but the same. Just stay down. Okay. So there, we've killed two, and I know there can't there can't be any more than seven. What are you guys? Oh, hello. My controller keeps acting up, and he keeps on wanting to go to the map for some reason. Alright, we can get two of these guys, maybe? Maybe? Oh, no, just one. 
You know what? No, I'm not wasting any more shotgun shells on this on these fools. Oh, he got me. Whatever. Got a little bit too close for comfort. That's fine. You, sir? It would be nice if I had more handgun ammo, but I'm pretty sure there's no more left. Is that everybody? No, you're 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 still ticking. You know what? No, we're gonna knife you. Oh, I'm on dangerous. Realized use that herb. I didn't even know because I had moved. Uh, I had moved a lot. All right. Just knife you. Maybe you'll die quicker. Oh, of course you did that. Of course you did that. Oh, and of course you. I knew. I knew that was gonna happen. My on caution. Nope, I'm still on fine. Is that all the zombies? Yeah. Okay. That's all the zombies. So basically, I had to go all the way back through. So that would be all of the zombies and enemies, rather, in the police station accounted for. Now, running a little low on handgun ammo, and that's fine. I know I'll be, get, I'll be getting more, and I'm doing better off for ammo than I thought I was going to. Now, I'm 99.9% .9 sure that I've killed everything. I'm thinking back to all the rooms I could enter, and I've entered every single one of them and killed, um, well, everything I can. At least for this run. Now, I'm sure B scenarios are probably ten times more tough, especially with Mr. X and all that malarkey. There's no other herbs or anything around here, is there? I don't think so. You can't really search this area too much more. Alright, so let's go see what bin. You wanna know? Yeah, there are more herbs. Remember um, when I said there was there's that cell that's right before Ben's? Yeah, there's a green herb and a blue over there. I left it there on purpose because I know I'd be coming back. So, Mr. Ben. Ben's gonna split in half. Talk about the chief of police being a co-conspirator, something along those lines. Yeah, all right, well, Ben is now dead. I think. Mail to the chief, I'm not gonna read it. But yeah. Ada, wait. Where are you going, Ada? I'm going, goodbye. Yeah, Ben is dead. What did that say, a miserable death? Yep. Yeah, he got split in half, what do you think? There's nothing in here, that looks like a very uncomfortable place to sleep. Now, if I remember correctly, did I leave the herbs in here? Okay, I did. That's good, because we are now officially leaving the police station. We're good. And we're entering into the sewers. Mwahaha. Which, uh, isn't too bad. And we've got a little bit of help, but we do have a problem before we, uh, we have a big enemy to face, which is not too bad. But, um, basically, basically, um, the, the thing that infected Ben in that cutscene. I didn't really show it too much, but yeah, you gotta face that, or, or no, you, you'll see. It's just, it's just bad news. You don't want to fight that. Now, I'm hoping to God that the friggin' spiders didn't re um, reappear because I did kill them, and I'd hate to have to. No, they still seem to be dead, which is good. Yeah, this is good. All right, and luckily there's a save room right here because I'm not gonna save. But, I'm going to get what I need to get. Which is, um, a couple of key items. Alright, so let's see what we got here. I'm going to, um, what am I going to use? I need a submachine gun. I'm going to put away the knife for now. Actually, no. Here, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to combine these two. So why not? And, what else do I want to do? I don't have any ink ribbons on me right now in here. So I'm going to just take this one right here. I believe it has, okay, it has two. That's fine. And then I'm going to put it away. I do have a full heal here, but I'm not going to waste everything I have. All right. So the reason why I have the machine gun for a very, uh, very good reason is I need to uh, kill a big giant enemy, which is known as the... Uh, G-type or something like that. G-type mutation, embryo mutation. It's really not too bad. Just fire everything you have at him. You'll see. I'll let this cutscene go just because it's pretty gross. Alright, I gotta fight that thing and then it vomits up little embryo guys. Really not too hard of a battle. He's really slow. Just that's what I do. Just unleash on him until it dies. These guys will latch on you, but they're pretty easy. 
Yeah, just, just do that. And what sucks is even if you get by him, even if you manage to run by him, and you can't, you still can't escape. You or you have to actually kill him. Gee, yeah. See, now he's dead. He's dead now. Now I got these things on me, latching on my crotch and shit. Get off. Yeah, get off of me, Christ. Yeah, they did put me on caution, though. Which is better than anything. Yeah, that guy, he really just... He does swing at you, but it's like a really slow movement swing, and it's really not that... Yeah, 68% of that still... I still have a good, decent amount. It's not bad. I'll go back to the handgun. What was that all about? Running off like that was reckless and stupid. Yeah, that's great. Basically, he yells at Ada for running off, blah, 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 blah. She's like, all right, we'll do it your way, Leon. Quit being whiny baby. And then we're on. So now we're in the sewers, which is full of other things I have to kill. Nothing right now. Oh, I know what I'm going to have to be facing today, though. Not today. Maybe today. I'm going to take these herbs. Just because. Might as well take them. You know, getting poisoned and shit. Don't want to have to worry about that. A lot of moss there, too. That's kind of gross. Alright, so we're now, right now we're back into another save room, which is nice. And we can actually access and get more ammo and more goody items for ourselves. So that's, you know, something to look forward to. So let's see here. What do we have for us? Well, let's, let's go to the save box first. We will put away these blue herbs. Oh, actually, the sun machine gun, too. We don't really need that anymore, either. It was just for that fight, and we will use it later, but it's just not necessary right now. Um, more ink ribbons. Let's go put that away. Just trying to consolidate all of my... Uh... There. Now, I believe there is... Um... Where is it at? Yeah, there's something in here. I think it's a first aid spray. No, more handgun ammo. I'll take that. So there's a there's a secret hidden behind here. And it's not that much of a secret, but it's just an area where you can go down and get some stuff. Um, now there's no enemies down here, which is good. All right, so there's some oil lamps around here that I have to light, which will show off some. Yeah, see, it basically just good thing you have the lighter. So we have a magnum clip here, I believe. Magnum is always a good weapon to have, and then I believe there's one more. I believe it's shotgun shells, if, if I'm if I'm correct. Has to be, unless it's more uh, magnum ammo, but not. It's shotgun shells. Yep. So we're kind of getting up there. We're kinda starting to slowly get back um, all of our goodies, which is good because I've started to dwindle down there for about a bit, and I'm glad that I have more uh, a bit more health items than. Thought I would have. All right, so something I forgot to grab. I'm definitely grab it. We'll go ahead and put these away too. You know like that? Is grab the valve handle. You do need it. Okay. Now we can go down the lift finally after a thousand years of going through. Hmm. I'm coming to a part that I was just thinking about. I'll, I'll let this happen. That woman was... I have to talk to her. Apparently you do. So now that I'm Ada, thinking of it to myself, there's an area where there's a lot of cockroaches, and I wonder if I can kill them. I'm not sure if I can. I'm going to fire off a shot at them. I mean, it, it is worth getting like hit once, I guess, but I'm, I'm not sure if it's worth... Uh, Worth the, worth the trouble. We'll see if I can actually kill them. If I can, I guess I have to, you know. Kill everything, run, and all that noise, so. Yeah, let's see. No, 
much they're dead. I've never spent more than like three seconds in this tunnel. Well, I have to know. Well, that was a bit of a doozy. Not really. That wasn't that hard. I was expecting it to be a lot worse. Well, there's a giant cutscene here that I'm basically just going to have to sum up for you. Alright, great. So basically, this is Annette Birkin. She's William Birkin's wife. You no, know, she's a spy. Cutscene about William turning into the giant monster, and that's that. So, like I said, I know I'm cutting all the cutscenes out, but watch the watch my video or my let's play of it if you don't want um, if you want to see it. So, yes, they are. And she, but then he pretty much bitch smacks her over the edge, and that's that. So this is pretty much the end for Ada. Well, for Ada's run. Douche, douche. So we go down here and oh no, there's a monster down here. What could it be? Ah! That apparently. Ada. Well, Leon got up. So Leon got shot, but he's cool. He can handle it. It's just a flesh wound. So I am on caution though, which is a bit of a buzz kill. Hmm. You know, thinking about it, I'm going to go back up here really quick and grab the submachine gun. Or do I want to grab the submachine gun? I kind of want to, for a couple of reasons. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, um, what am I going to do? I'm going to put the, um, I'm going to put the shotgun shells away. Yeah, that should be enough. I grab the submachine gun just because um, there are spiders coming up and they can poison me. And I just don't want to have to waste all my ammo for my shotgun and my main weapons. And I've got this big thing on me, so we're gonna go ahead and use that. Hopefully, it's not stupid doing that. But what are you gonna do? We'll just have to see how it goes, I suppose. Hopefully, these diders, diders, spiders die pretty quickly to it. So. So, there are zombies and there are spiders, but the zombies I'll just use a handgun on. Zombies are down at the other end, I believe. Now there's the eagle, there's a, I believe there's a magnum ammo over here too. Oh, the wolf metal, which I need. And shotgun shells, which I put away for a reason, but I guess I'm just going to keep them again, because why not. It'll be fine, we come to a save box uh, soon. Yeah, hello. Yeah, stay on the floor, please. You. Not you, where are you? You're coming on the ceiling. Where are you going to be? Did that do anything to you, sir? No? Hello? No drop acid on me. No, stop it. Where are you, where are you going to be? Where the hell is it? Oh. It's also dead. Okay. Yeah, okay, you're dead as well. Fine by me. Wish some of you guys had more ammo, but, you know, whatever. Come on. Where are you? Hello. Yeah, shoot off your legs, asshole. You're dead, too. Yeah, I would not want to waste my shotgun ammo on it. Die, bitch. Ah, uh, that is very satisfying. There's only those ones. I've never killed these guys before, so it's, it's kind of cool that I, I get to kill them now. Alright, so we have one of the medals. Um, we get the other one up here, but I just wanted to clear up some item space. You know, speaking of that, there's a lot of stuff over here and herbs and shit that I probably should grab, but I'm not going to be able to. Hmm. See, those will be, there's some blue herbs right there, just in case you got poisoned by the spires, but I didn't, so. So I only have two item spots. But what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to use that uh, blue-green herb combo, just because I am on caution, so I might as well just um, use it anyways. Alright, so, I'm going to go ahead and use that. Oh, and also remember, when you're, when you're using the valve handle, don't use it again, because then you'll make a walkway happen right here, and that's very... Uh, 
could have happened because if not, you got to take the long way around and it's just really annoying to have to do. Skipping the cutscene, which is good. I love the GameCube version for that, that you can skip things. We have a lot of herbs here too. I'll take you, green herb. And I believe there's two green herbs here. There is. And shotgun shells. Thank you very much. And there's a... Um, I think there's an ink ribbon there, but can't bother taking it because I need to have one item spot. All right, so we come to a turning point in the battle, which is probably the biggest enemy in the game, but it's also the easiest enemy in the game, and I'll show you that for uh, I'll show you that in a moment. Ada! So uh, yeah, giant alligator. A little bit of slowdown, so I apologize for that. So, if this is the first time you've ever faced him, he may seem like a little bit overwhelming, but honestly, just run. Don't try to shoot him, don't try to do anything, because I've unleashed everything I've ever had, and it still doesn't take care of him. So, you see that thing I just went out, you press that button, you aim, you wait for him to bite it, come on, you wait for him to bite it, and presto changeo. He's very dead. Yeah, he doesn't have an upper half of a face. I'm actually walking through him. But yeah, that's the easy way to do it. You can unleash everything, and usually you don't even kill him at that point. He, he, um, he just gets really pissed off and goes through the wall, and, and that's that. So so this video, I believe, is going to run a little bit um, longer today, just because thinking of uh, where the next save point is at, and it's not for a little bit. So... Um, yeah. I know, bullet wounds, blah 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 blah, I just found out John's dead, and basically he confides in Leon, Leon's awkward about it, and then that's how that goes. Basically. Alright, so we have one thing to get here, so we're basically going reverse through now, now that we're in Leon. Oh, that scared me, I thought I was gonna, I was gonna, I was gonna crash, I would hate for an emulator crash, because I have not saved since I started. Alright, so... Another good thing about keeping the valve handle on us, because you'd have to go the very long way back around and it's just very annoying to do it that way. And I have to go through this way anyways because um, some zombies get up and kill everything run. I gotta kill them all. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and skip that. So I'm pretty sure, and I hope to God, that when I go through here, there's no more of those uh, cockroaches. because. I don't want to have to waste all my ammo on it. It is one thing, because it's her stuff. Nah, they are all still very, very dead. Alright, good. I'm, I'm glad that we, we've come to that uh, decision. Alright, so, we got some zombies now. Always a good thing. I'm trying to remember where the zombies are actually at, though. Oh, I remember. They're, uh, and what's good is Ada will help you through this. So normally you just run through this. But, we gotta fight them all now. Yeah, come on, stupid asses. Ada, w it would be nice if Ada helped. What, what sucks is Ada can't actually kill the zombies, is she can only, I'm getting a lot of slowdown here. Sorry about that. Is she can shoot them down, but she can actually kill them. I like how the zombies float when they're dead. Oh, is there another one down there? I don't even know where he came from. Alright, is he dead? Yeah, when they float, that means they're dead. This guy is definitely not dead. Ada does help, though. So she can, like, literally... Yeah, she fires when you fire, so that's good. Is he dead? Oh, you're, you're still there. Get down, Christ. You done? Yep, you are a floating corpse. Does anybody else get up? Anybody? No? Is that it? Okay. So I believe that's all the zombies, or there might be some in here, I can't remember. I usually just run past this part very quickly, so it's... Anybody else? Usually just the spiders, but no, the spiders are dead now, so... No we're having to worry about that. No, not that. Alright, stops the waterfall. Then I can just cut the cutscene, because why not? I know, it cuts the cutscenes are so bad. So... We're pretty much just about done with the uh, sewers. Pretty much, I say. But, you know, it wasn't that bad. I thought it was going to be a lot worse.
Alright, so we are going to be on the trolley. I don't think there's anything over here. I gotta start the trolley though. Yes. Over the sky tram, sorry. So there's a part coming up right now where um, William Birkin, he busts out his arm right here. You'll see in a second. Where he does that. Now, I'm not going to waste my ammo, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to speed it up. And just like that, it's done. Yeah, normally with that, um... Normally with that, I shoot it myself, but, um... There's really no point. I'm running... I just realized I'm pretty low on item space. It's because I got that submachine gun with me, but I had to kill the... Kill the, uh, spiders with it. So there's another important item I have to get. I only have one space for it. Weapon box key. Now I'm gonna consolidate these two green herbs together into one. I know it's wasteful, but I need I need a, I need a spot for a couple of reasons. So the weapon box key. I won't ruin it for you. You'll see when I do it. But so yeah, there's like a billion zombies. Not really a billion, but there's a lot of zombies in here. But I'll have to do some backtracking to get all the items in here because I know I can't do it one single. One single run. So we're just going through and kill all these zombies. It's not a big deal. I have to, so. Oh no, he's getting back up. Watch out, Leon. You never see really Ada ever get hurt by any of this, so it's it's really Yeah, this guy's not dead, I, I can tell. Oh yeah, yes, he's bleeding. Shoot Ada in the face. But there are a lot of zombies in here, and I could just use a shotgun, but you know what? Let's go ahead. Let's use one shotgun blast, just because why not? I'm kind of running low on handgun ammo, actually. Double headshot. I'll take it. There's actually very something very important over here that I'm going to take. It's the shotgun parts. Now, the shotgun parts you use to mine, got the custom shotgun now. It's a custom shotgun. That thing is loud as hell. And I'm not going to um, waste ammo showing you, but... It's still pretty great. Now I have another set of uh, another set of zombies to take care of, and then I'll be uh, hunky dory, I suppose. I want to need. Yeah, I see you here, sir. I. Oh God! Don't bite me! Don't bite me! Nope. I would normally just let friggin' her take him down, but why not? Right. He's dead, he's not. Stay down. God. No, stay down. So this is basically, this is the way back up, but we're not going to go that way just yet. Because, well, there's a zombie over here. I think there's just one. To be wrong, but... Where is he? No, he's dead. Alright, so there are just two green herbs here. I'm not going to waste it by going back up. I'm just going to combine this into a super herb, complete mixture of that. The same thing as a red greener um, mixture, but I just didn't want to have to take the fuss of having to go all the way back through here, which I didn't have to, so that's good. Yes, I will go up the ladder. Thank you. This video is running a bit long, but you know, whatever. It's 30 minutes. You don't have 30 minutes for me. I don't know what to tell you. So we're gonna go ahead and drop this off. Wait, we're gonna drop off, drop off the valve handle, the weapon box key, and this big herb here, and I'll just take one, that, and that. Now there are some things over here which we need, which is shotgun shells, of course, and more magnum bolts, which I'm not gonna use. I'm not gonna use that right now, but for our next. Um, thing we need to do. I'm going to take the submachine gun. You'll see why in the next video, unfortunately. Take these, uh, where, the, where are my save? Okay, there. Oh, the shotgun shells, too. No, no, stop. Take, take, yes, okay. Right, let's go ahead and save. Oh, more ink ribbons, why not? More than merrier. Old typewriter. I will save. 
I will save over three. Alrighty guys, well, uh, thank you for watching this video. I appreciate it. I hope you guys are enjoying this. Uh, it's a little bit hard going through the sewer, but it went a lot better than I thought it was going to. But yeah, um, next episode, we're going to go down to the laboratory, which will be the final area of the game. But until then, until then guys, thanks for watching.